Hello and welcome to Therapy Express with Rosanna. Thank you so much for watching today. Now this video isn't going to be like my normal video where I tell you and teach you ways that you can feel better. I've talked about how to fight and fight fair, how to not react. I've taught you about communication. I've talked to you about um, calming your anxiety in these horrible times. I've talked about COVID. I've talked about being too close in the time of COVID. And just basically, I've addressed a lot of the horrible things that are going on in the world. Today, I want us to shift our focus, to take away our attention from all the horrible things that are happening still today and shift them on to something very positive. And the way we do that is by looking at the things in our lives for which we are grateful. So they talk a lot about oh gratitude, do a gratitude journal, be grateful. And you know, we kind of skim over that like it's not really important, but it truly is because when we're looking at all the negative things that are going on in the world that comes into us and it fills us and then we tend to look at the world from that lens. So if we're looking through a muddy window that has a lens through it and everything on the outside looks distorted, it's not because everything on the outside is distorted, it's because we're looking through eyes that are looking through this very tinted uh, lens, right? So what I want to do is I want to be able to take that muddy lens away and to be able to look at our lives from a different perspective, to look at the great things that are going on right now. And before you say, no, there's nothing great going on right now, I beg to differ. Yes, there is something great. The fact you're even looking at this video and can hear me, that's pretty great, right? You can actually hear and you can actually see. You've got sight, you've got hearing. Amazing stuff. But we tend to forget the little things that are around us, the little things that we love, a family member, uh, a food that we get to eat that we love, all that thing, the breathing, the air that we get to just like <sighs> breathe and exhale. That is an amazing thing. And yet we take it for granted because we're not focused on the wonderful things that we have. We are focused on the horror that is out there. And I've talked enough about that. I've talked about how to manage all of that and things that I do that have helped me. So this video, I'm going to put you to work and I want you to think of three or more things that you have in your life for which you are grateful. I don't care what it is. It could be a plant that you water that has grown into this beautiful, amazing uh, plant in your house. It could be your next door neighbor. It could be your son. It could be your grandchildren. It could be a favorite book that you're reading right now. It could be the fact that you're able to get up in the morning and walk and have your coffee and call your friend, text your friend, uh, check your social media. It could be as simple as that. That's the stuff we take for granted. And we're looking at all this stuff, but that's bad. But what about the good stuff that's going on? So I want you to focus on that today. This is a short little video. And I'm going to, at the end, put a pictures of the things that I'm grateful for in my life. And it's not too hard to find. When you sit down and you start thinking, well, what am I grateful for? Oh boy, it starts coming. It starts coming. So I want you to do that right now. Take just a minute to start thinking of three little items that you're grateful for. Just three. If you can come up with more, then great. And that's going to make you feel better because you're going to shift your focus from negative to positive. And remember, you don't have to be positive all the time. I talked about that in my last video. But you can be positive sometimes by giving yourself a little gift and saying, you know what? 
I really do feel good. I'm really grateful for my friend Janie. I'm really grateful that I have a car that runs that's not in the shop. I'm really grateful that I was able to get up and go for a run today. Whatever it is, it's there for you. So if you would do me the favor and in the comment section, write your three things. I want people to start focusing on the positive today. Okay, next week I'll come up with another video to help you manage something or teach you about something else. I'll do that next week. But for this week, I want you to think, pay attention to all the things that have meaning in your life and write those down, share it with us so that we can be grateful that you have things for which to be grateful too. Okay, that's it. That's your assignment for today and, and throughout the week. And you don't have to think of them all today. You can, as you go through the day and the week, you can be writing things down. It's going to make you feel so much better to be having in your mind something that you really enjoy and love. And you think, my God, I am grateful for that. Wow. All right. I hope you enjoy my, my pictures that I'm going to put up of all the things that I love. Well, not all the things that I love, but a lot of the things that I love that are meaningful to me that I find um, to be such an inspiring and motivational and just uh, a wonderful presence in my life. So anyway, that's it. That's it for today. Easy, easy peasy, right? Subscribe, turn on your notifications, share this on and look for me next week. Until then, make every moment count. Bye.